Welcome to Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, the arena of the supernatural, where supernatural is natural. Our vision is to bring Christ's abundant life, knowledge, and hope to Inanda, then to the whole world, in the form of preaching, teaching, holistic gospel, healing, deliverance, counseling, training, and discipleship. Here we go. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, Jesus is Lord. That single belief calls us together as a community and sends us into our world with hope and purpose. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, your past will never define your future. There is always redemption, which means there is always a brighter day. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we do not think that we are better than any other church out there. We are just doing our best to become our best. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we want you to believe in God, but also we want you to know that God believes in you. We are not against any people who do not attend church anywhere. Instead, we pursue them with love, the very same love that is pursuing us. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we are committed to serve God and people. We take ownership and account for our decisions, answerable or accountable as for something within one's power. We do what we say we will do. We are learning to serve God with all our hearts and we are learning to worship Him with all our lives. And if you are looking for the perfect church, we are not it. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we will make mistakes, but we will choose to grow from them. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we are part of a global community that is knit together by the resurrection of Jesus. And by the way, at Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we believe that really happened too. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, we will engage with people who are in real need because we are the hands and feet of Christ. And finally, we need you to hear this loud and clear. At Mount Zion Carnation Ministries, it's not our church at all, but it is His and we live and move and breathe in His church for His glory and fame and not for ours. So there's the invitation. You are invited to jump in with your whole heart at your own pace and experience the life that awaits you in Christ. Friends, this is going to be good. Welcome to Mount Zion Carnation Ministries from Dr. Swanem Somi and Tabisilem Somi. If you regard other churches as wrong churches, how do you and yours know is bad, right? Once that yours is the best church. Njoma masonde maningi ganje and unkulunkulu seems like ku kipiba e izu lulake ilanga la ku kipela bonga band umoya wa ku kipela bonga band. Why when are you so bitter in your heart and wanting to control it zindo ugu tizenze ngende la ya? And as there are so many churches out there and we see our God, His sun shines off. It shines all over everybody. Uh, <laughs> Maybe Munye Uti or Bugilo Sisilo interpret a ganja. Can you do a better job? Can you interpret better? Okonongam challenges on interpret. So if you can't, don't say anything. If Ungawazu Gwenza Logunga, can you be interested in something going haywire and you say there is beauty in this? Ungabona in your intuibonti or Nagala, go to Besubo, can we train ourselves not to be irritated by things? Can we train ourselves to go in the mist, Yabanda Banga Kolo, and be the light? Can we train ourselves to go in the mist, Yabanda Banga Kolo, and be the light? Can we train ourselves to go in the mist, Yabanda Banga Kolo, and be the light? Can we train ourselves to go in the mist, Yabanda Banga Kolo, and be the light? Let me say again, I have a personal train. Let me just say, she is Umzaluan. But imagine if we go to the selective, if we go to the Shabazaluan, but can you imagine if that trainer can only select the, the saints only? Do you think business is like a call? Do you think that business will grow? Why do we want a bandaba fan and not a bandis in Tonjing Hat? Why we only select people like us? Because once we have alumni and go lawyer to a faggy panda, and a bonu, she can be Jesus and Pilonia Lomunt. 
Because once you exclude other people, those people might be abangaba uchesu empilwe niyako. Right now, we're asking God for more opportunities. But we are locking those doors again. Because subconsciously, we are not ready to go to the opportunities. Because in everything, we see the devil. We see the witchcraft. We see the haters. How are you going to be great? in that situation. If we fail to be greater, you miss church because of somebody else here? She's over greater than in relationship, even exchange any gum sab. How are we going to be greater to change the world? Lapemnyango is the survival of the fittest. Out there, kukusimama aba neikwepa. I believe nyanga bazalwane sizakelama kukunz. Angikolwa uguti sizakele ikoke lozei. Sabalege luglimala. We We became so fragile. I'm coming out from that. I'm coming out from that. It's no longer my portion. I have the strongest forehead. Sometimes I might say it as if I'm deceiving myself. But I will keep on saying it until this lioness in me comes up and roars. Have you seen But he lives in you. That lion lives that with kingship is in you. That lion. Simba has, but when we pubesi, yes. sound is sound yako. It's raw. When we pubesi, sound is sound yako. It's raw. When we pubesi, here that lion grows in within you. And for a long time. You've been looking But when you are the child of the most high God. You need to walk in confidence. Not doing something to prove a point. But to be you. And to stand in God. And knowing God dwells. You are God. Amen. Amen. Before I want to go quickly Ngela Payagu Johan chapter um before so. I lose myself, let's go to the book of John chapter uh no um, Matthew, sorry. Um, Matthew, Matthew chapter ten. Oh um, Matthew is a sugar ten. Oh verse uh, 15, sixteen. Verse sixteen. Yes. Matthew 10, verse 16. Okay? As time goes on, not today. Right. So, look, I'm sending you out as sheep amongst wolves. Right. So, be shrewd as snakes. And harmless as doves. I like that analogy. Because when somebody says he's shrewd, that person doesn't play games. That person is cunning. And observant. And observe everybody. And plan against those people. And security Identifying opportunities. And people are complain And he also watches the ones that are in security teams that are in negligence. If you use that other corner, they are so negligent. That means we need to be cunning. That means gufanele sibe jenga zinyoga sibe not to go by number. Sibe nobu. Inyoga ngiti cunning. Inobu. Kya sabi sugu yanga senyogen. It's like oh, sibe jogo satan sibe. You feel skeptical when you are told that you must be like a snake. Is there any demons where you are? 
Ubona je ngaphansi kwa stage khona itekhona efakiwe ngibonile njibhokisela imnyama hlabe phakathi And I said the snakes around there where they work in their pulpit there is a snake underneath Bonila na mhlanu goyi ngube imnyama See when they are dressing wearing a black dress Ubonile la bhangela lifakile Did you see Yal sola le la bhangela I suspect that uh, that bracelet Yazi uthini You know Your heart is true. You can stay where there are so many snakes and not be harmed. So But the problem is your heart. And the word of God says masihlakani phenje ngayinyo. How do I do that? Ngikwenza kanjani loko. Ngibalansisa kanjani nje loko. How do I balance that? And then masenenze njani mese nthobe kanje ngani? Bese and humble like doves. Okay. So kusho ukuthi ube ngala. So it means I'm on the other side. Ube ngala. And the other side. Ube ngala. And on the other side. Ube ngala. Other side again. Ube ngala. Other side. Kusho ukuthi leso sikali senze njani. What does that mean? Fona lesenze njani? Ngoba ukwenza go to because I do both. Awushi sihamba bakuhlaza ube inyoka ube inyoka ube inyoka ube inyoka uzobona ufona nobani. Thiwe ba iba ima njenge inyoka nibe njengamadada kusho ukuthi uthi kanje. It means you go both sides. Ukhona umuntu ongabi vigilant mayiphi edlala lomdlabo wokuqondisa. Ne understand lento ngisho? Hani manje understand nani? Kusho ukuthi uyabalansa uphila impile balansile. So it means you balance both. Your me, life must be balanced. This is my interpretation. It means ngimi. Ngibalansile ngimi partner indawo. It means I am standing in the middle and balanced. If ngimi partner indawo, I'm not going to find myself If I'm standing in in the center in the middle being worried about his in day negative angeke ngizithola engikhathazeka ngezinto ezenzeke ngikhulume ngazo ngicaba ngengazo speak about those Ngehebe. things and gossip about those complain and ngikhalaze ngibona amaphutha and see mistakes but for the same time futhi ngesikhathe sodwa I will not be ngeke ngiyibe excited ngihlala ezinto ezinhle ngizenzile izolo ngihlala kuzona ngikhathazeke ifuna ukugama ngezinto engizenzile ifuna ukuthandwa ifuna ukuba muhle kusho ukuthi ngimi phakathi i'm just myself inzimba le that means i'm not going to be influenced by you clapping hands for me ukushayi bayanthanda ke abazolona bayanthanda ngishayela nizandla no i am who i am I'm not being influenced whether people love me or hate me I'm just doing the will of my father Angeke ngizengikhohliswe izandla zabantu kodwa ngizomalaya ngikhona ngazi ukuthi ngakhiwe ngomfanikiso kangumuntu You know we see abantu bephakamisa abantu bebazonda at the same time We see people elevating It's because people we sihlala lo mdlalo lo ukuthi ngithandeni ngithandeni ngizonjabulisa ngizonjabulisa ngizonthanda nezonthanda mhla abantu bengakunakile we uyakile side ngala isikali sesithe Then you go to the negative side but we need to balanced. say what has the lord said to me finally lots looking cause she look mean i'm going to be loyal to what god has said to me gizothembeka kulokho unkulunkulu akushi lo kumini whether this person no mbizelwe ke yenu yashintsha but unkulunkulu lo kanishi lo ilo kakushi but i am who god says i will stand I am. because usathana ungena ngnamubani because the devil can possess anyone but me na if i stand and trust the lord god amenga bengimile ngikhona ku no was sent for such a time as this was the yugo thing to because if i keep quiet god was trusting me to stand in my knees and to stand aligned with him so that the will of the father will happen ukuzintando kaNkulunkulu izobonakala when i move how can the glory of god be if the soul is not seizing that means finally that it is laughing apart that means it is to be thrown away that is what we are seeing today he look is bona why but that is all laughing apart where the church will but it is not what if was true god will raise someone else ukuNkulunkulu izobonakala he will raise people who have been Muslims who come in and serve God like they are praying. He will raise people like the 
who have been serving for Satan for a long time. But we will be left aside. We will be left in the wilderness because we are complaining. We only see mistakes. Yes, we walk with God. Who is the fire? Who is the pillar of cloud? But we can't see his power. We speak about things that do not matter. I am making a commitment. It's not easy. But it's easy. Did you hear me? It's not easy. But it's easy. So I am standing. Knowing what sustains him below you. He's the one who sustains my life. He's the one who carries me. And I trust him alone. I'm not trusting any human being. I'm not even trusting my husband. But I'm trusting the God. God. The one who doesn't change. And if I am, he has commanded me to love my husband no matter what. To love you no matter what. That means we are going to come out from this is into that means you need to come up from complaining that I'm not loved. They did not compliment me. You are going to say I was doing it for the Lord. Do everything unto the Lord. But when you do it for me and you observe me how I react, you have already disappointed yourself. Let's go to the last one. Chapter 6, verse 7. Umak. Why is the baby is a baby? Show me an ambili. Wakala ugubatu manga babili. Wabaniga amanda pezu wawo moya abanguli leyo. Wabayala ugubaba nga pati luto lwendela. Kupela utondolo lotwa. Banga pati na singwa, na skwama, na tusi emkagini. Kepa bafagi katulo. Bange mbati kotwa ama banji ama bili. Uwati gubo, nagu upilapo ningena kona enlini. Thala ni kuyo, nize ni muge kona. Na ii pindao, enga ii kuna mugela, na lapo benga yugu nizwa kona. Anoti ni muga guyo, ni vutulule utuli, olupanti guze nyao zenu, kubengu bufakazi gubo. Baswe behamba, beshumayela uguba abantu ba penduke. Bakipa ama demoni ama ningi. Bakoba abakulayo ama aba ningi nga mafuta. Baba pulugisa. Amen. Siyabu nkulu nkula gabu sisi zulaki. What I like here is that when Jesus called ama disciples. Intengi itanda ula utu chesanga liskate biza bafundi. He said don't take anything. Wati ninga pati. I mean tatani logo uguanele. Take what is enough for that moment. That means what Jesus is saying is taking us back. Let us master the now. Because Izolo is gone. Because the yesterday is gone. Use Izolo as an elevation gangkulunkulu man. Sebenzisi Izolo njengo paramisunkulunkulu man. Ngabula li bele, ngabula li ngonyam. I kill the bear and the lion. Oye long filist. What is this? I'm taking what happened yesterday and I'm using it now because there is something that I'm facing right now. But if you're going to take problems of yesterday and use it now, you are going to be stuck in yesterday. And you are going to feel worried. You are going to be depressed. Or maybe you leave tomorrow. You think about what can go wrong tomorrow. Then it means 
means you go into the future. And then you look now as you look. You always say, I don't have it now. God but has declared our millions it, up. We've been declaring millions. God are they? Yes, on to an, I I've been att- attending church, but things don't happen. Zega, then but once it happened, then I will be okay. Then it becomes a problem. Because when you look at something that you don't have, and forget so good you are here in this body, then you become you become disappointed. You start questioning Whereas God says, I've done it all. You have it all. But you are looking at your condition. You are looking at the pain that you are feeling. And you want to be healed now. And you, if it doesn't happen now, then I'm losing hope, I'm losing courage. Because God was supposed to heal me now. But if you don't stand and wait for your healing while you are trusting God while you are praising him while I am saying father you are good I am feeling this pain but I am trusting you I know that my healing is coming I know that I am already healed because by your stripes I was healed even if it doesn't happen I am standing in your hope because hope sustains me in the middle of the storm I know that you are my anchor. I feel discouraged right now. I feel empty right now. I feel confused. But you are my anchor, Jesus. I don't have the answers. I don't have the understanding. But I'm standing in you. But you can choose to say, Why, Lord? Why me, Lord? Why are you not healing me? And it doesn't feel like when you are praising God. Today I will choose whom I'm going to listen to. Before you, there's a blessing. You are the one death. who stretches your hand of faith and choose. Unfortunately, God is not going to choose for you. But He says, stand in the middle. Don't worry about tomorrow. Don't worry about yesterday. Just stand right now and appreciate what is happening right now. And thank God right now. And and praise God right now. And when you do that, you shall enter my rest. You shall see my goodness. Everything that you want shall come unto you. Everything that you desire will give it to you. Because you are mastering right now. And I'm telling you, when you come and pray, believe that you have received it. And you shall have it. It means when I ask God, I already know that it's mine. I already know that I've prayed. I, I, I have been provided for. And I stand in that assurance where my desire and my expectation are in one place. I know exactly that goodness and mercy shall follow me. When do we reach that level? Do you know what you reach? By starting to invest in your life and applying the word of God not We are so addicted when we invited to preach. Because I want to be powerful. And then, powerful, but empty. And your character is not matching up what you've just said. It's just a show. No more. For me, I'm saying, Lord, help me. Because I'm not willing to play that game anymore. Because I'm uncountable here. This is my life. I'm the one who's going to stand before God. Not my husband, not my children, but me. And I cannot play a game anymore. I cannot gossip and talk about people. I cannot complain and talk about what I don't want. Because we are living in a cycle. We are chabula manji akala chabula manji akala manji. It's part of life. So why do I make the other side greater than the other one? When I'm in suffering, I praise God. When I'm happy, I praise God. When I'm being 
And when I cry, I cry while I'm praying. And Jesus said, Do not cry as those who are hopeless. Where is your hope? Can we make a commitment, Pastor Shots? Then we're going to love each other, no must disappoint done. I love you anyway. Even when we come to a place where something is Even if we reach a point but where the only are thing that I will give to you is love. I won't stalk you on the stage to check if you are I'm waiting for my God to strike God you that? down. Do you think God thinks like you? His love is steadfast. His love is unchanging. He remains yesterday, today and forever. May we move and become like him. May we make a statement in this generation. Yes, Ulimele. Yes, you are hurt. I know maybe you are hurt. I'm also hurt. By you. But it doesn't matter. I love you anyway. I am pledging my love for you. Even when I feel like I'm not going to say that, but I will speak life over you. Because what I say to you is what I say to myself. We are together. We are together. If I'm envious to you, I'm not jealous to myself. If I crossed your for you, I'm not jealous to myself. So what I will do, I will elevate you. I will open opportunities for you. I will encourage you. Because when I do that for you, I do it for me. Amen. 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 I would like Mount Zion. We've been through so much. But in the ending, but what we need now is to now is to live like Christ Jesus. Christ is to be your, my brother's keeper. If you have, you have forgotten that can, we you you can we remind um, you um, um, Once I forget I will forget I'm telling you something but here, but here, but I I know, know, Because it is God, God in me was speaking right now And you, you said, said hey mama God, do you remember Do you remember when God spoke He said this and this and this Do not even say I'm the one who spoke but say what one, two, two, three, four. He I, said, I, 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 so many, Mama. Now let us go up. Let's stand I, so up. Mama. Let's stand up. But sometimes but others but don't think don't don't the truth is I do get get the truth is I do get Yes, sometimes I feel like The truth is sometimes I sometimes feel like giving forget. up. I feel like but when you up, see it, God, and you say God, God is giving me a mission, you're putting your fagu mama in form, you're putting him paramis, so they're taking a pelele. So that she won't be left up. Go back, Sasa. Now you're a pagamis, I mean. So that tomorrow she will we be elevated. We need each other, Baselwan. See, I think Anna. We've been in a battle for a long time. Yeah, but we're still in this cut We can't pretend we're going to cut cut a sick battle with Fagamasut. Sing as in the sing as. But now we need to change the garment. What a man does change. In the new era, we are changing the garment. We new era. But before that, we squad. So we're going to go to the Fagamasut. But before we accept the change, we need the rehabilitation. We need the rehabilitation. Any rehabilitation. 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 Hey, I'm losing the old mind, and I'm, I am upsetting the mind of Christ. Oh, for this level, level Christ, for the level that I'm in now. Life has many levels. I've been listening to us as a Bazalan is a I was listening to us as pastor. Sometimes we stand here and we tell you something. When something has changed, we blame you and introduce when I will say I'm not God, but I used to say I'm the one. I'm the one who will give you a blessing. And then my section children say, "Why are you not God?" But I will say, "Why are you making me God? Because I am not God." Amen.